In this quick video, I want to show you how to fix Genshin Impact no longer working when you click on it. So if you're running Windows 10 or 11 or 7, whatever Windows operating system you have, and you, you're playing Genshin, you keep clicking on the icon on your desktop, it's not responding, it's not launching, I'm going to show you how to fix that. So first, restart your computer. That would be number one, and if you haven't done that already, and then see if Genshin will open up. After you restart the computer, what I want you to do, if it still doesn't open it up, locate your Genshin icon on your desktop in Windows 10 or 11, whatever operating system you have. Right-click on it, and then when you right-click on it, I want you to go down and left-click Properties. And then from there, what I want you to do is Run Compatibility Troubleshooter. And you do that by clicking on Compatibility up here, and then Run Compatibility Shooter. That might take a few minutes. Click Apply, then OK and see if you're able to get in. If not, I want you to, what I want you to try to do is do an update on C++, which basically that is the uh, replacement for Java. So basically that's the programming language of Genshin. And uh, most likely this is not going to be the issue for you, but you can, you, can, you can type in C++ in your search and see if you're able to update it. But most likely that is not going to be the issue. All right. Next what I want you to do is Re, re, um, check for updates for Windows. So what you're going to do on the very bottom left of your computer, click on update, or type update rather, and then look for check for updates. And if it's in an older Windows, like Windows 7, you will need to click on the little Microsoft icon and then in the magnifying glass type in update so you can do an update. You probably already have them, but if you don't, that might be the issue. Restart and then see if you're able to get into Genshin. Next, what I want you to do is do an update on the video driver. And in order to do that, you have to go to Device Manager. So type in Device Manager here on the very bottom left of your Windows screen. And click on Device Manager. And what you want to do is locate Display Adapters, which is right here. Click on it. And whatever driver there it is, or whatever video card it is, this is an NVIDIA. But again, it will if it's an, I, uh, if it's an Intel or whatever version that you have, AMD, click on it and then click Update Driver. That'll take usually a few minutes. Restart the computer and see if you're able to get in. Next, I want you to locate the icon again on your desktop. Right-click it again. And then what I want you to do is go to Properties, left-click Properties, and then go to Compatibility again. And then right here where it says Run this program in Compatibility Mode for Put a check on there and then hit the scroll down and do choose Windows Vista. And then click Apply and then click OK. And then see if you're able to get into Genshin Impact. And then if you can, you can go back in here and then go back and then click this and make this Windows 10 again or whatever version of Windows that you have. And then finally, last but not least, you'll need to uninstall Genshin by just going to Programs down here and then choose add or remove and it shows all your programs just search by the largest because Genshin will be a large file choose your game and then click uninstall that'll take a few minutes and then reinstall Genshin Impact but hopefully you don't have to do all that. All right, I do appreciate you watching and make sure you subscribe